In this video, we'll be looking at IGCSE Biology, specifically Pearson Edexcel IGCSE Biology. Before we begin, you need to know there are two subjects for biology in Pearson Edexcel. There's biology or general biology and there's human biology. Both of them are different subjects, not different papers, different subjects, but don't worry, I'll be covering both in this video. Before we begin, both subject papers have MCQs, short answer questions, calculations, extended open response questions, and diagram drawing questions. So there are varied types of questions, and of course calculators are allowed. Moving on, let's look at the first subject, which is biology, also known with the codename 4BI1. This subject has two papers, paper one and paper two. Paper one is two hours long, and it constitutes for 61.1% of the total IGCSE, is for 110 marks, and it assesses all of the content from the specification except everything that is bold or has a B reference. The specification is also linked down below so don't worry. Also paper one is more based on textbook knowledge. It's not that practical. Okay coming to paper two. So paper two constitutes for 38.9% of the IGCSE. It is for 70 marks and it's for one hour and 25 minutes. It assesses all the content from the specification and whatever is in bold in the specification is covered in more depth and it's more of a practical paper. Moving on from the biology subject, let's look at human biology, which is the other subject in Pearson at Excel IGCSE. It has a code 4HB1, has two papers, both of them for 90 marks, both of them 1 hour 45 minutes long, and both of them 50% of the IGCSE. Even in this one, paper 2 is more practical, while paper 1 focuses more on textbook knowledge. And that's it. That's an overview of IGCSE biology, including both subjects available. Links to the specification and guide are down below. Thank you for watching.